Well, some tough, windy conditions uh, for the players for round three of the BNI Indonesia Masters at the Royal Jakarta Golf Club. And, and plenty struggled, like Suridit Young Jurenchai. He started off 6 6, double bogey, bogey. Not too much to cheer for the young Thai golfer, but this was pretty good, wasn't it, at the 14th? But a round of 75 that's seen him slip back to eight under par. Another really not making too much headway was uh, Justin Rose, the defending champion and world number two. Rose with only two birdies on the card. They both came at par fives. A couple of uh, drop shots in the card as well before a birdie finish for a 71. So Rose is at nine under par, which is quite a way behind the leader. Panapol Pidiyarat played some of the best golf at times during round three. In the end, he had to settle for a round of 70, but Coconut, like Jazz Jane Watadanon, looking for his second win of the year. Jazz winning the uh, Queen's Cup back in the summer, and Jazz with a round of 69, which was the second lowest round of the day. The lowest came from Henrik Stenson, the Swede. Justin Rose's Ryder Cup partner at the Golf Nacional in with a round of 68. He's uh, best spell of the round came just before the turn with birdies at seven, eight here and at nine. So Stenson is at 13 under par, and he's the closest pursuer to our overnight leader, Pum Suksansin, who uh, started the day with a three-shot lead. Saw that increase to five with some brilliant shots like this one out of the sand at the sixth hole. And he played faultless golf on the back nine. No drop shots and just the one birdie which came here at the 14th, a round of 70, and the 2016 champion has a chance of doubling up at the Indonesian Masters. The 70 leaving him 16 under and leading by three.